On Saturday, Shia LaBeouf almost decked a German fan for trying to take his picture, but by Sunday, his antics overshadowed the film he was in town to promote. Shia LaBeouf caused a stir during a Berlin promo stop for his racy new film, Nymphomaniac. The actor who previously announced he was retiring from public life showed up to the film's press conference donning some seriously dirty duds. The 27-year-old kept quiet till he was asked about the film's graphic sex scenes. When the seagulls follow the trawler, <laughs> it is because they think sardines will be thrown into the sea. Thank you very much. Instead of answering his first question of the day, LaBeouf quoted soccer legend Eric Cantona's 1995 apology, and then he stormed out. After the dramatic exit, his nymphomaniac co-star Christian Slater was quick to chime in. Obviously the script is, is packed with a lot of... Uh, sardines. Sardines. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> One sardine after another. LaBeouf's statement didn't exactly come out of left field. He's been tweeting famous apologies since December when he was busted for ripping off a 2007 comic in his short film. LaBeouf's bizarre behavior continued that day on the red carpet premiere of his new flick. All eyes were on the actor who topped off his tux with a paper bag that read, I am not famous anymore. He's been tweeting that same phrase since January 13th in response to criticism over his short film scandal. Safe to say this could be his latest attempt at performance art. James Franco was in Montreal for the launch of his new book, Actors Anonymous. And as expected, fans were eager to scoop up every copy of the novel. I have to ask you, there's hundreds of fans out there. Some of them have been waiting for almost 24 hours. <laughs> but how does that make you feel? Just looking at your face, how does that make you feel? It's pretty crazy, but I'm touched. What, what is it that you love so much about uh, this city? Well, I was here um, over the summer shooting the first part of the, the movie that I'm doing, Everything Will Be Fine, with Vim Vendors, and um, I just found it to be a very uh, literate place. You know, it was, it was exciting to see, like, you know, bookstores on the street, you know, like, in a lot of the places I, you know, I, I spent a lot of time in, you know, you see this bookstores fading away, and so it seemed like, a, you know, a good place to do a, an event like this. Martin Short brought his act to Mississauga this past weekend to help raise funds for the city's hospitals. The 64-year-old who just shot Inherent Vice with Joaquin Phoenix told Eva Fragiscados what the mysterious actor is really like. He's really, really a sweet man, so ridiculously talented. And not, you know, not kind of what you'd think, not like always in character, laughing and jokester boy and, and uh, a great, great spirit. From SCTV to starring alongside Oscar winners, Short has come a long way, but through it all, he still keeps his old castmates close. You know, that SCTV group never hasn't been back together. You know, Andrea is my the aunt to my children. You know, Eugene lives down the street, Catherine lives 10 minutes away, uh, Dave Thomas and I had breakfast last week. You know, it, 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 everyone just has never lost touch. Aw, and as always, we want to hear from you. Just tweet us at Ant City.